So the garden is producing quite a bit. So uh, too much zucchini and squash for us to uh, consume. So I'm gonna make some zucchini bread. We have flour, we have sugar, vegetable oil, um, baking soda, baking powder, a little cinnamon and uh, vanilla extract mixer and uh, the zucchini. So we're gonna start making it. So the first step is to spray this with vegetable oil. So just sprinkle the flour around uh, so it sticks to the sides. Three cups of flour. One teaspoon of salt. One teaspoon of baking soda. One teaspoon of baking powder. Three teaspoons of ground cinnamon. In the second bowl, we'll do three eggs. We'll do one cup of vegetable oil. We'll do two and a quarter cups of sugar and one tablespoon of the vanilla extract. Cup vegetable oil, two and a quarter cups sugar. I'm going with an eighth instead of two and a quarter, so two and an eighth. One tablespoon of vanilla extract. Now add the wet ingredients into the dry ingredients. Use a spatula to get the rest of this out. Now that the dry and wet ingredients are mixed, we need to grate about two cups of zucchini. One cup of zucchini. Second cup of zucchini. I kind of pressed it down so that way we get a little more zucchini. One cup of diced walnuts. So then we add our walnuts. Now we'll stir it with a spatula. So we have it stirred all up. Now we're going to put it into our pre-prepared pan. The oven set at 325 and we'll cook 40 to 60 minutes depending on your oven. So now it's ready to go. So we'll put it in the oven for 40 minutes and then we'll check it with a toothpick. If the toothpick comes out clean, we'll know it's ready to take out. We'll let it sit in this pan for another 15 to 20 minutes, and then we will drop it out of this pan and let it cool the rest of the way. Well, we might eat some uh, while it's still hot. So I'm trying some of these as cupcakes. So I sprayed the pan, put some flour, shook the flour off, the excess, so we'll see how that goes. I was going to do these for about 15 minutes and then I'll check them and see if they need a little more time. So the bread has been cooling, so now we're going to take it out and put it on the cooling rack. So now we'll give one of these cupcakes a try. It's moist. Good flavor. The taste of walnuts was great. Came out awesome. Got the recipe from allrecipes.com, so check them out. Um, came out great. I don't know if I would do anything differently. 
It's only my first time doing it. So uh, we're gonna do uh, two more loafs. Um, these ones we're gonna do uh, with pecans. So we'll, uh, we'll see how they taste with pecans.